The Young Hotel Gaze Award 2013 took place this year uh, at Dele Meridien in Vienna. The diversity participants could choose from three different topics, or the impact of social media, as well as the potential impact of the third runway at the Viennese airport. And the third topic was how can Vienna increase their ADR with taking in mind the competitions such as Bratislava Prague and Budapest. And I found all the participants very professional, very mature, and many of them proved to be very creative. The importance of an event like this is that the young people have the possibility to show what they know and to show uh, what spirit they have because I think they are very enthusiastic and they are very uh, fit in their profession. It's definitely a gain for the participants, uh, a gain in knowledge because they uh, go through a lot of trouble to, to research certain subjects which they normally might not have to. An excellent training to stand in front of an audience speak free, have a presentation and, and the second thing is you get exposed also to, to uh, hoteliers, to the community. How can Vienna continue increasing error trade and yet stay competitive with destinations such as Bratislava, Budapest and Prague? As you know, Vienna is known and loved as a cultural, tourism and conference city all over the world. In 2011, the number of events held in the city increased with 7%, the number of international congresses with 10, and the number of corporate events even with 49%. With special offers and family packages, we can increase the status of the brand Vienna. Keeping with the slogan, the next leisure guest could be the future business guest. 69% of all international tourists are traveling by plane to Vienna. In 2012, we had more than 22 million passengers. Of course, not all of them are staying in Vienna, but as you see, 15 million actually are staying in Vienna. And in conclusion, I just can quote our director of tourism that the third runway is the lifeline for the success of the tourism and convention destination in Vienna. I'm going to talk about social media, friend or foe. You need to make it funny, you need to make it short, you need to um, think of something creative that nobody has thought of before, which is of course not easy. You will see also an increase in guest satisfaction because that person feels special in your hotel. That person feels like he knows you a little bit better. In, in my honest opinion, social media is a living organism. It's, it's people, it's customers, it's users, it's communities. Very self-confident, it was very nice listening to you, we enjoyed it. And, and thank you very much for this really good presentation. All the presentation proved that uh, they were very, very uh, passionate about the hospitality industry and about the topics they have chosen. Yeah, I think they should be innovative, they should be open to every new trend in the hotel industry, especially with social media, I think we can all learn a lot. And, and uh, yeah, openness is the most important thing and of course the training you do with this presentation. Well, I go home with a, with a very good feeling to know that there are so many great young people out there who uh, will continue to thrive and uh, to make sure that the hospitality industry thrives as well. I think that that new generation of young hoteliers are ready for jobs that do not exist yet. Mm -hmm.